So hello everybody, uh, I'm Ari Partinen, working for Nokia Imaging uh, today here in London to give you a short demo about the new Lumia 925 imaging capabilities. So we have pumped up the imaging capabilities uh, quite a lot for the new Nokia, uh, Nokia 925. Uh, but what are the hardware differences from previous is that we have actually introduced completely new optical design. The new optical design uh, is really impressive. It consists of six lenses uh, to improve the sharpness, daylight and low light. And even more impressive it is because the whole new six lens design is completely suspended uh, by the optical image stabilization. So we are actually again moving the whole lens stack to compensate for the any hand shake in the image. On the software side, um, the big improvement um, is for the low light. So maybe the most visible uh, and obvious improvement is that we have pumped up the ISO range quite significantly. So previously the ISO went from 100 uh, to 800, but now it goes all the way up to 3200. That gives, of course, four times more light in a low light uh, situation, giving significantly better brightness in the low light. Also on the software side, uh, we have been really busy. So we have improved the noise filtering, the color rendering, uh, the sharpening. So the whole software stack has got really good improvements uh, since, for example, the 98. Also really nice, cool new feature uh, is what we call the Nokia Smart Camera. Uh, for that, we have a, a demo here with the skateboarding guys. So the Nokia Smart Camera, you can always start it from the native camera application. And what the Nokia Smart Camera does is that it uh, captures 10 frames and stacks those together. All right, so a lot of, lot of movement there. We can open that and open that in a Smart Camera. So in a Smart Camera, we can now edit that 10 image frame stack uh, as we wish. So what it first suggests is, is the best shot. So it automatically calculates and tries to estimate what is the best shot out of those 10. And that's what it provides me. It's a nice, good colors, sharp image. Another option is the action shot. So with the action shot, it allows, it gives, uh, allows me to stack together uh, multiple images uh, with the same background, so much like in the skateboarding magazines or snowboarding magazines. It's very, very cool. Motion focus, that is something um, also completely new, something truly unique uh, for the Nokia devices. I think that's my favorite. I like this also. And cool thing is that I can select my hero frame, maybe there, guys nicely in the center, and we have the motion blur there. So it's cool. And these type of pictures are really difficult to create if you don't have the, get the help from the software. Because otherwise you have to follow the movement very closely, very carefully and try to get the background blur. I think this one is super easy. Is the, is the aperture different or uh, the lens? Uh, or the, ap the aperture is the same. Aperture is 2.0, so it's very wide angle, good low light optics. Uh, field of view is uh, 28 or 27 to 28 millimeter depending uh, which aspect ratio you are using. So it is uh, a 2.0 lens uh, with a very wide field of view.